All right, what are we gonna get up first today? Karamucho wa osawagi. Harin kis to os okashina nakamatachi. Well, this sounds familiar, but, um, yeah, let's dive right in. So, I did indeed play one of these not too long ago. This is based on the Karamucho potato chips, or, you know, potato sticks, or other potato-based products is what they sell. So it's, uh, you know, another one of those tie-in things. I can't hear the game at all. Also, also, looking at the game, holy crap, what? <laughs> yeah, that's probably not a good thing. So it's, uh... Huh. Okay, so it's... Like, an even more basic crazy castle. I guess. Well, at the very least, the game itself works. <laughs> Even if the, uh, cutscene was garbled to hell. Hmm. Okay. So we go... squish. Or we don't go squish. Okay. Can I get back out? I can... <laughs> I don't think this game is... Uh, oh, oh geez. The keys, the keys are broken. <laughs> Everything is broken. <laughs> so, um... Yeah, I mean, this, this game looks proper. It, it looks perfectly playable and possibly even enjoyable. Okay, I'm going to assume that if this ROM were working properly, that <laughs> would in fact kill that dude. So, I'm gonna take a moment, I'm gonna go find a new ROM and hope it works better. Alright, so, turns out that was not a ROM problem, but it was something with uh, MGBA, so for the time being, we'll just pop this open in VBAM. Is, but at least it's not glitching out this time. But, uh, you never know. So, yeah. <laughs> so, 
like I said before, it is a pretty decent little, um, sort of, uh, crazy castle-esque thing going here. Still don't think I'm actually gonna play through this entire thing. Hmm. Okay, so that doesn't work regardless. Now I'm really curious about why that exists there, but... Either way. <laughs> Good to know. God, I can ride the bat. <laughs> okay, I actually was not expecting that to be a thing. Oh, I see. thing. Uh, see, this goes... Oh, that would allow us to look around the stage if it were bigger than one screen. Right, so, guess what we want to do is not destroy um, that creature. So that's the thing. When you have the power up, it will disappear after a short while. So do that very quickly then. It's, it, it's a trap. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that to be a trap. than I expected. Not expect traps like that, or other things of that nature, so yeah. One. Okay. Good to know. This is feeling more Solomon's Key-ish now. Alright, so that is continue. Uh, that is return to the world map. Then we have save, load, and stickers. And stickers do we have? Oh, that's for... Okay, I think it has use with the Game Boy printer. Okay, so... Oh, now we have invincibility! Fair enough. <laughs> Amazingly brief invincibility, but even so... Right, that only lasts for a very limited time, and why... Okay, that is a thing I shouldn't be using yet, because I don't have all the keys. I wonder if this 
water kill us? Yes, it does. I would expect so, because we're a potato chip, so... Water would be a pretty bad thing to encounter. Uh-oh. I may have done things in the wrong order. Nope, nope, we're good. Stand on him. We cannot. Okay, so only certain enemies can be stood upon. Again, good to know. And if we want that possibly coin, possibly stake, Icon, then we'd have to get there before we got all the keys. Mm. So it's just a normal block with a different icon, so it probably isn't just a normal block. Herb. that one up. Alright, so we'll be just for getting rid of him. Then we go up and then we do stuff. Okay. The game kind of relies on a lot of trial and error. But again, that's kind of part and parcel to this sort of puzzle game, so I guess it works. So I have no idea what's up with the stuttering, but again, I'm only going to be playing this for a tiny little while longer, so we can put up with it. And again, I'd assume that's for use on him. This one, but let's do that with that. What's in the chest? Ah, sticker number 33. <laughs> Great sticker to get first, I suppose. No, that's not gonna work out. We'll wait. Because, like, obviously there's nothing majorly... You know, never mind, there is not one. There is, uh, no real info about it. So I was going to check and find out, you know, is it 10 stages for the first world? Is it 30 stages for the first world? But, barring that information, I'll just go ahead and... I'll play through until... Stage 10, see if it, uh, does in fact end World 1 there or not. Although I think there's only the... You know, I think there's like five worlds total based on what we saw from that world map, so... Not honestly sure. It seems like 10 would be a small amount. Okay, the mouse... Uh, it's a fan we can ride on. I don't know why that's a mouse icon, but... Yeah! So where was the exit? How do we... How do we get back out of here? <laughs> we, we can... Maybe? No, we can't. Well then. Murdered and... Oh, 
slightly. Ourselves a platform. Of course, I could have used it from the other side of the wall, and it would not have mattered, but that's okay. It all works out. that or could have done it from there and then gone up there. Either way works. Simple stage. I like it. One has all the um, icons in it. We got sticker 25. Oh, okay, for getting to 10,000 points, we got sticker number 25. Okay. Should have seen that coming. <laughs> okay, so yeah, um, we reached stage 110 and did not actually reach any kind of ending. Again, I didn't think it would be because 10 stages would be very short for this sort of thing. But, um, yeah. A pretty interesting and honestly pretty good kind of puzzle game. I would say, honestly, kind of recommend it for a potato chip <laughs> brand name tie in game. This is honestly good. So, um, yeah, give this one a shot. Um, that said, I am basically done here. <laughs> 